Hello everybody, General Geek here, and uh, today I'm showing you the second version of my MAEP MAPE. So, um, uh, where to start? So, if you haven't seen the old version, it's basically just a simple obstacle avoiding robot made using the Arduino. So, its name comes from Mobile Arduino Experimental Platform. Because basically it's just a experimental platform for the Arduino that moves around. So I've got a breadboard here. I haven't actually soldered together any of the circuits. So then I can change them, uh, mess around, learn new stuff, etc. So my old one just used a couple CDs for the chassis. Uh, this one uses the uh, aluminum, I believe, Bobot chassis. So it's of a much higher quality. Um, it's got tons of mounting holes on it, so I just took two of the standoffs that came with it, and I was able to mount the Arduino there. Alright, breadboard rubber banded on. Um, and so, the whole reason I redid this is because originally I had this sharp infrared sensor on a panning servo, um, on, in front of the old one. Um... So, I got this ping sensor for Christmas, and so I decided to um, use this chassis instead, because I didn't really feel like learning to program uh, PBasic anymore. I, didn't, I wasn't too interested in the basic stamp, because I liked the Arduino better. So I just put my Arduino on that chassis, hooked that up, um, and decided to put the infrared sensor down there. So this way I can do uh, cliff avoidance. I still need to program that. Uh, I never got around to it because I was actually fooling around with doing line following using that sensor. Because I noticed when put over a white or black background, it has some different differentiation. Although it's pretty slight and I haven't gotten a working program yet for that. So I'll show you what I've got right now, which is pretty much the same thing as my first version except uh, redesigned to use the ultrasonic sensor. And the code is on this robot's page on let's make robots dot com. Uh, I gave it some Creative Commons license, so license so you're free to use it. Just give me credit and you can't use it commercially. And you can change it in any way you want. Alright, let's turn it on. Alright, plug the nine volt battery in. That's uh power the electronics and logic and stuff and then turn on the motor power and there we go alright put something in front of it like a hand it'll look both ways and go the other way see it appears to be shortest alright let's grab a backpack and it'll be alright I put it a bit too close alright All right, hand both ways go that way because I like what's right here go that way And it seems to always make a good decision, so I put my hand right here, put my hand right here, it'll turn away from my hand. So the wall turns that way. Excuse that wall, excuse me, turns towards that. That's all. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Bye.